What's up everyone? Welcome back to Pokemon Insurgents as a wild Mew appears. As a wild Mew appears. Everyone's... Uh, you gotta, gotta try and catch Mew. We gotta... Listen, Mew. Someone's gonna catch you, okay? How do you feel about this? How do you feel? Someone's gotta catch you, right? Mew. Mew. Mine back off. Oh my gosh. This is pure power right now. I, I go up first. I get first shot. One, two, no, Mew! You tease, I almost had Mew! One shake for Jim. No, bumps out immediately. And Joker throws a ball as well. Can someone catch Mew? One shake. No. Mew, we were so close. That was so close. Mew. As Mew flees away. Get back here, Mew! Maybe Mew will join us later in the episode. Uh, YouTube, welcome back to Pokemon Insurgents, episode 30. Uh, we just defeated uh, Celine City's gym, and we saw Plot going this way. So we gotta go find Plot. Uh, there aren't usually any trainers on this route, uh, so I wouldn't worry too much about that. It's too close to the ruin, and people are worried that it might get damaged. That's fair. That's fair. Not too many trainers out here don't want the don't want the ruins to get damaged. I feel that. Some creep with a stun fist and a typhlosion went up to the dragon ruin earlier today. I wonder what that was all about. Man, I, I've been sitting here wondering the same thing. The view on this route is absolutely beautiful. Yeah, we should have we should have went for a master ball. Should have went for a master ball. Uh, yeah, the master ball is defective. It happens. Got a max repel. I won't use that on Mew, I promise. Promise we won't use that on Mew. The Dragon Ruins. Dragon Ruins. Dragon Ruins. It's almost time for Dragon. Dragon Ruins closed. That's kind of sad. The Dragon Ruins are closed. Let's see what Pokemon do spawn in the Dragon Ruins, though. <clears throat> All right. What do we have that spawns in the Dragon Ruins? Pokemon. Charizard spawns here. For Alligator, Sceptile, Credilly, and Golurk are some Pokemon that you can see here. Um, that's pretty cool. Uh, surfing Pokemon, you get some typical stuff. Fishing Pokemon, typical Pokemon, you get that way. Uh, and there's also a, a Reshrom, Zekrom gift here, all that fun stuff. Uh, I figured Dragonite would have been here. Huh. I guess that would have been too easy. I guess that would have been too easy. To, to slide in Dragonite. I know Dragonite is somewhere in this game because I've I, I know I I've used Dragonite in my previous run. Hey, there's Charizard. A level 60 Charizard. That's pretty dope. We'll run away from that. We'll run away from that. I feel like at this point a lot of this game is just us getting plot stuff. I really don't need to fight a lot of wild Pokemon um, or trainers to really get levels because we have level stuff for that. I don't know. How do, how do you all feel about about that in a Pokemon game where you aren't really... Wild trainers just aren't really what's going on. It's the only... Bzz, bzz, the only real threat is... Like, the actual story stuff. Hey, kid, it's me, the director. Listen, you were a hit. People love you on TV. Would you mind coming back down to the broadcast tower? We need to start filming the next episode right away. It's time for us to film our next episode. Yo, what happened to my Max Repel? Charizard was like, Max Repel? Nah... Nah. Max repels don't stop. Oh, I can't escape. Don't slash me. Don't, can't, can't, can't escape again. Third time's the charm. No, it isn't. Sure isn't. Third time is definitely not the charm. All right. All right, Charizard. All right, Charizard. All right, Charizard. All right, okay. No, I'm not going to use my next Pokemon. Charizard, what are you doing? First off. We're using a max repel. And you're telling me that's what's going to happen? Secondly, you won't even let me run away from it? I get it. I get it. It was It's a Venusaur. And, you know, I, I know Charizards are pretty, you know, irritable around Venusaurs. Uh, you know, and, and Blastoises, because Charizard feels like he's the best. Well, you know, let's, let's, let's calm it down. We can all be friends. This isn't even the right way to go. Also, why is my Max Repel 
uh, repelling literally nothing. Hey, Weedle, that's almost as good as Mew. Very, on very similar levels of excitement that you'd see, you know, very similar. That's a dead end. Alright, let's, uh, let's go this way, maybe. I honestly think I was, I'm more excited for Weedle than I was for Mew. What if I were to tell you the Charizard was going to eat the Venusaur? I would cry real tears. You would see real tears. Well, probably not real tears. It'd probably be fake tears. All right, that's not a pathway. Um, oh my gosh. Dude, I, I, I think, like, one of my biggest irritations in Pokemon is when wild Pokemon pop up, and I'm like, I have no interest in a wild Pokemon right now. Like, I'm trying to do something. I think it is honestly one of my biggest irritations in the game. Okay, that goes nowhere. I think more so when I'm like a actively using a repel. You would have seen real fake tears. Yeah, they would have been real fake. Oh, repel's effects were off. Oh, were they were they on? I hadn't noticed. Um Well, that's also a dead end. There's an item over there. This goes up. Was there something up top? Alright, what if we... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Water. Water. The imp instant Lapras. Popping across that water like nobody's business. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. Making moves. Making money moves. Team twenty fifty two for oh yeah I, I did definitely uh the magnet's right there it's it's a uh, health I probably would be helpful to pick up because I believe it boosts electric type moves um and if we are about to go to a gym uh that is a water gym they said they specialize in rain and I don't really know what that means go lurk dude I love go lurk like I'm gonna be honest with you all I really dig go lurk. I think it's a really cool design, really cool Pokemon, but I just have no need of it in our current run, uh, just because we kind of have the the psychic angle it provides. It can provide us a ghost angle, uh, but eh. Almost out of repels. Can I pass through there? No, I can go around this way though. Just leads me straight to a wall. I thought we were making progress. I, gen I genuinely thought we were making a lot of progress there. I was like, ah, oh, shoot, we're climbing. We there's got to be a movement up there I missed. Because there's no way... There's no way this isn't how we get up top. Right? Right? Like, this has to be the way we get up top. One of these pathways. Okay, so it's obviously not that one. Gotta be. Got to be. Here, wait, here, wait, here, wait. Uh. These are the only knights I could do. Sorry, responded to a quick text. Uh, with Shek Tyranitar, my memory is great. Can learn Thunderbolt if taught. Um, it might be able to. Oh, shoot. This way, right here. I don't think. I, uh, I kind of have rice for that, though. I, I feel like Titar. Titar has, has the Darkened Rock, and it has Ground as well with Earthquake. I think, if anything, I might want to drop one of its Dark moves uh, for something else, but I'm not sure what else we would take it to. But I don't think we need both uh, both Dark Pulse, and I believe it has Crunch as its other ones. I don't believe we need both of those. But I don't know what else we would want to uh, teach to it. Oh, for the next gym. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. There we go. We made it to the top. Oh, Wiz, I'm so glad you decided to show up. I'd like to imagine dude's just been standing up here with Norm being like, oh, 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 wrong way. Oh, here he comes again. Oh, oh, ah, he hit a dead end again. This is the my moment of triumph. Every time I failed, you were the there to witness it. After we trained to create the perfect Delta Pokemon, after we experimented with Mega Evolution, and the incidents with Pokerus, 
A Malad. Hmm. And now that our experiments with armor failed too, you might think we're running out of ideas. Tell me, Wiz, Nora, do you know the myth of the Univan dragon? Legend speaks of a gargantuan dragon that once reigned over all of Unova. Its power was supervised by two brothers, the princes of the region. However, these brothers were constantly fought over their beliefs. One seeked truth, one strove for ideals, and finding no middle ground, they split the great dragon into three. Reshram, truth, and Zekron, ideals, emerged where Kyrim was left as the dragon's empty husk. This ruin is very, very ancient. While the dragon did rule in Unova, the war between the brothers was in Torin. In fact, the great splitting was at this very spot. A shrine was built here in the hopes that one day the dragon might be formed once again and bring peace to the land. That day is today. While Rokra has been busy experimenting, the most important job in the Perfection Cult was left to me. It was difficult. I needed three different legendary Pokemon, but I succeeded. And now, oh now, the original dragon was said to be the sign of leadership, of wholeness. And represents an opposing beliefs, finding neutral ground and working together. The idea of harmony and of perfection. Once we summon this creature, we'll be unstoppable. The only thing left is to begin. Reshram, Zekrom, Kurum. It's time to return to your origins. Join together and become whole once more. Ignis et Frugla Fentum. Can you just fly to the top? That'd be too easy, obviously. Oh, oh. And now, great dragon of Unova, the divine perfect god. Emerge, the great name here. Name here? Uh. What'd you say? Oh, maybe you didn't hear me, dragon. I said emerge, the great name here. Namir? Namir! Namir here? Are you reading that off a scroll? Uh, yeah. Why? I'm pretty sure you're reading that wrong. I think you're supposed to say the dragon's name at that part, not just name here. It's probably a placeholder. Oh. Huh, that's what the parentheses are for. But hold on, that's impossible! Nobody knows the name of the original dragon. The only names that survived were Reshram, Zekrom, and Kyurem. How are we supposed to bring it back then? That's a great bit. Fine, I was hoping to resurrect the original dragon today, but it seems like that's not happening. I'll find that name. I'll search every scroll, text, or book until I learn it. But for now, I split you into Kyurem White and Zekrom. Come forth and serve me. No, they weren't fighting. They were fusing. I'll deal with the two of you here and now. This is the end of the world as you know it. It's the end of the world. Probably. I guess we'll find out. Yo, I do, I, I, listen. I know they're a cultist. But you can't tell me that that outfit isn't just real, real nice. They got like the Pokeballs on each side of the leg. Like, come on. Come on. That's a great outfit. That's a great, great outfit. Um, all right. Let me actually, uh, let me get some info on what we're going to be fighting here. It looks like we are going to be starting off, uh, with, uh, a Metagross. Metagross and Salamence. Oh, yo, are we doing a double battle? Oh, shoot. Oh, we're fighting with Nora. Oh. I. Okay. We're fighting with Nora. I think this is our first. I wasn't prepared for this. So we're fighting a Steel Psychic Metagross and Dragon Flying Salamance. Um, so Metagross uh, weak to uh, Ground Ghost Fire Dark. Salamance uh, weak to Fairy. So we'll just we'll just target. Uh, we'll target a, a, a Moon Blast on Salamance. Sacrifice your teammate. Always and forever. Especially when it's Nora. Especially when it's Nora. Bum, bum, ba, bum, ba, bum. All right, they go for sticky web. Webs were spread on the field. 
Thanks, I'm sure that's gonna help us out, probably. Yo, Metagross, please don't attack me. Metagross, please don't attack me. Thank you, okay, at least got a Moonblast off. I feel better at least getting a Moonblast off. Yeah, sure, solid, solid, solid. Great AI, yeah, absolutely target on me. Don't force me into a double battle and then not even target my, uh, not even target my friend. That's super fair. Uh, I think we're gonna go, I think we're gonna bring out Ragnarok. I think, honestly, think I'm gonna go for, actually, Metagross is weak to Dark. We're gonna go for a Dark Pulse. Struggle Bug on Metagross. I'm hoping the Sandstorm takes out Salamance here. Ragnarok, Earthquake, everything. That was my other thought. But then I was like, oh, he hammer armed me. I love this battle. I love being forced into a double battle and then not even getting to, to actually do anything. <laughs> I love this. I love this for me. I love this for me so much. I love this so much. This is great. I love everything about this. I love everything about this. Oh, hey, at least you took out Salamance. That was real helpful. Super helpful. Oh, look at all that damage you did to Metagross last turn, too. Oh, Momo goes up a level for absolutely nothing. Super effective. Not very effective to Levani. Actually, that's honestly a decent, a decent move. Levani's dead, though. That doesn't really matter. Sandstorm rages. The sandstorm didn't hurt either of us? Okay, dope. All right, coming out with Typhlosion. Good old Typhlosion was caught in the sticky web. I assume that drops their speed. Um, this could be a Mega. Uh, weak to ground. This could be a Mega. Yeah. Typhlosion. Mega evolves into... Yo, that's cool. That's a really cool Mega. You can tell that that was definitely um, inspired heavily by uh, by Charizard. Like by Charizard's Mega, because that looks really cool. Hidden power. Critical hit on you. Oh, I'm going to kill him. I'm going to super kill him. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye, Dermanitan. Killed by ally. That's fine. Hope Can I one-shot Typhlosion? Nah, that'd be too easy if I did. Sandstorm Rages. Typhlosion was buffeted by it. Thanks. Alright, they're probably going to come out with Kurum or Zekrom at this point, right? Kurum. Um, caught in the Sticky Web. Who are you coming in with? Coming in with Flygon. Coming in with good old Flygon. Kurum is raising a blazing aura. A b -b 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 blazing aura. Uh, so Kurum here is a Dragon Ice type. Good old Dragon Ice. This is actually, technically, this is White Kyurem. Uh, I don't know if that changes their ability, their type effectiveness um, at all. Or if it just changes their abilities that it can have. Uh, they're weak to Fighting, Rock, Steel, Dragon, and Fairy. Um, damage normally by ground and all that fun stuff. I'm just going to go for another Earthquake. Because <clears throat> I need to take out... This Typhlosion needs to... Needs to get, which a Muddy Water also would have done the probably similar. Me, uh, Mega Flygon looks really cool. Uses Earth Power. Watch it kill Typhlosion. Okay, thanks. You made me useless. You made me useless. AI, couldn't you have tell, tell, you know, figured out that I was attacking them? We're getting some big XP for this. Can't learn Hammer Arm. Um, Hammer Arm is a fighting move. No. Yeah, you don't need Hammer Arm. Goes Draco Meteor onto Flygon. <sighs> One shots your Flygon. Special attack harshly falls. And then Momo's finally going to get to attack here with an Earthquake. To do almost nothing. To do almost nothing. The Sandstorm should be subsiding soon. 
Dewblade. Good old Dewblade coming out with uh, Zekrom. No, Luxray. Uh, which we might just go for another Earthquake here then. Uh, while we have Pokemon that are weak to what we're doing. Because I'm fairly certain you're weak to ground. Yeah, weak to ground. That's actually the only thing you're weak to. So let's just go for another Earthquake here. Fusion Flare onto Dewblade. Almost taking them out. Um, you take out... Oh, dope! Nice take out on Kiram there. Uh, Magneton leaves just for Magnemite to come back. Or no, Magneton comes back again. It's hilarious. Alright, Earthquake. Sorry, Dewblade. You can get over it, though, probably. Bye, Lux... Lux oh, Luxray, you survived that? Oh, darn. Big hit on us, though. Drop both your defense and attack. Sandstorm has finally subsided. Luxray was poisoned by its Toxic Orb. That seems unhelpful to you. Alright, now there's Zekrom out and about. Zekrom also still armored up. Forgot that there's Zekrom was still armored up. Uh, so let me see there's Zekrom here. Just to remember, I know it's we fought it earlier. Still weak to fairy, ice, and ground. So you know what? It hasn't it hasn't fall, fell felled yet. We're just gonna keep on earthquaking. Just gonna keep on earthquaking. Earthquake all night long. Luxray should be dead here. Bye, Luxray. Alright. Um Nora should still have another partner Pokemon. Okay. Florgus, have no idea how well that's going to go for us. Um, you know what? Just another earthquake. You can never too many. You can never drop too many earthquakes. Zekrom outrages. Momo might be dead. Momo's dead. Outrage, big hitter. But now it's a two v one, so we should be pretty okay. Um, yeah, we'll just come in with Rice. Rice is going to be very low on health. A uh, very low level wise. Almost a full 10 level difference, but our actually 11 levels difference. Rice is pretty quick, and they're caught in a sticky web. Doesn't matter anyways, Dazzling Gleam takes out Zekrom. Doesn't matter at all. Rice gained some big XP here. Get it to level 58. Perfectionist Cult of Steen has been defeated. No, impossible! Defeated uh, for what, the fourth time? We've defeated this dude a lot. <laughs> Impossible. Don't you know who I am? I mean, you definitely don't know the names of those dragons. Kiram, Reshram, Zekrom. Uh, what's happening? The ritual wasn't done yet. Get back together. No, no, Zekrom, get back here. Uh, Reshram. I'm glad you're okay. I you're not hurt, are you? You are all fools. This isn't the end of this. I'll bide my time. You better hold on tight to your friend, child. Because once I find that name, you're going to wish that Reshram was only stolen from you. Kiram, let's go. We're leaving. That was scary. Um, I I'm glad nobody knows, but I, I can't help wondering. What was the name of that dragon? Well, I have a theory. It's probably wrong, but, well, Kiram is the shell of the original dragon, right? It's what's left after Reshram and Zekrom split from it. And there's the fact that the fusions are called Kiram White and Kiram Black. Well, I don't know if any of you remember this, but back at the Ulterior Library, I was looking on a book on the Unova word structures. There was a page that talked about the legendary trio. Reshri was a prefix that meant truth. Zek was a prefix that meant ideals. Nobody really agrees on what Q means, but mostly, uh, trans most Translate believes it's, it's whole or complete. I never really questioned how little sense that made. Kiram is the, you know, the opposite of complete, after all. Tan said that the original dragon was perfect, a symbol of different beliefs working together. Maybe a more accurate translation of Kira would be perfect. Oh, wow, I never thought of that. <laughs> yeah, it's just a theory, though. Wiz, the Infernal Cult said they were in the mountains, right? We have to go after them. If we strike them before they strike us, maybe we can have a chance. Oh, oh, I nearly forgot. Your Mew can transform into anything it has the DNA of, right? That's how you use Shaman's ability to get around, even though you didn't actually have it. Why don't you take this? It's a hair from Celebi's head. We got Celebi's DNA. We can now transform and use the Tesseract ability outside of battle. 
To use Tesseract, you need to find glowing areas where space-time is torn. If it's white, you can travel back in time, but if it's red, you can move other objects through time. You're smart. I'm sure you'll figure it out. It's a lot less complicated than it sounds. Uh, just make sure you're close to the rip. Uh, best of luck. You know, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna time travel. Hey, Wiz. Listen, I I owe you one for helping me out and and Reshram too. If you need anything like to train or something, just uh, let me know, okay? I'd be glad to give you a hand. Well, that was fun. We didn't get taken over by a bunch of dragons. So that's nice. A bunch of dragons didn't, you know, take over. Our Pokemon are pretty decimated. Um, and no, wait, wait, we do have Spyro. I was going to say, no one knows Fly, but we do have Spyro on us. Uh, some forces keep you from flying here. Is it Plot? Is Plot the force that keeps us from flying here? Down. Have we done it? Have we escaped? We have escaped! Oh, and this is now open. Oh, wait. No, this sounds like plot. This place is bizarre. Such an odd place to have even built anything at all. I can't believe people live out here. Why is there a temple here, of all places? Ah, our guest of honor has finally arrived. Oh, what is this? Show yourself. Who on earth are you? What do you want? You're the one behind all this, aren't you? Oh, me? Behind everything? Oh, <laughs> what could you possibly mean? I've been researching... I know where the first auger... I know where Adam's crystal came from. I've looked into Persephone's past, which led me to the Zenith and the Infernal Cult, and what he can do. And all of it, all of it ties back to you. Oh, well, you've certainly done your research. Are you cultists trying to catch Giratina? Oh, no. We might look the part, but we're anything but. You've been playing us like pawns. You've been playing me like a pawn. Actually, I know you don't want to hear this, but you weren't part of my plans. You're a minor nuisance at best. A bit part. My intention was for the Infernal Cult to eventually overthrow the first auger and secure the crystal for me. But no, you just had to interfere, didn't you? You just had to play the edgy anti-hero, didn't you? You're evil. I'm surviving. Stay away from me. Don't make me break that crystal. <laughs> Any more than you already have? But I'll let you go. Your shard is nearly useless to me without the other two. And though I didn't care for you at first, you've slowly become useful. Enjoy your trip home, Jaren. You won't remember any of this. How did we witness that, though? How did we witness that? I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, except for the dragon ruins were were a great time. They were they were not as good as Dreamland. Dreamland was pretty great. We got to dream, dream, dream. But this was pretty good, too. And YouTube, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you should definitely come join us next time to see what happens. Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you in the next one.